Benitez's defenses are spread out all across El Este. Now's the perfect time to attack her headquarters. The problem is, we don't know how many soldados are there. So, here's what we're going to do. You, La Moral, the Ancianos, and that tank are going to quietly get on the island. We use that rusty tank to punch holes in the fort, then keep shooting until Benitez is dead. She probably planned for a lot of attack scenarios, but I'm sure pontooning a tank to her island wasn't one of them. Would you do me Rendezvous with El Tigre at the place I marked on your map. Come here, my baby Tigre. A big battle is on the horizon. I'm just happy everyone is getting along. You did this back in '67. It was Santos who could bring the people together. Today, you have that magic. <laughs> so, I'm Santos? No! You are me, the Fist! <laughs> now, before every mission, I find that if I imagine myself accomplishing it, I will accomplish it. There. I just imagined us destroying the Navy. We doing this? You kids today. You're so fast with everything. Take in this moment. The world will change in a couple of hours.
like this way is blocked. I'm gonna go for Benitez. Do it! We'll find another way in and connect with you as soon as we can. Aguerrilla has made it inside. Find them! Kill them! If you're not dealing with the guerrilla inside, then you're killing guerrillas outside! Presidente Castillo myself. Easily, Benitez. Hey, baby Tigre, you still there? See, si. seems to be fucking death around every corner here. Then make sure you're on the other side of those corners. Claro, El Tigre. Hello. 
Middle name. Benitez. Oh. 
rojo por rojo. ¡Viva la moral! ¡Viva la moral! Couldn't have done this without you, Danny. That's not a smart move. You should cut her down. Why? It's what that bitch deserves. You killed a soldier. Good for you. Except the thing about soldiers is there's always more of them. See, sí, Mama. Same mistakes, new faces. You're just bitter because your revolution came and went, and all you got was a fucking mountain. <laughs> Enjoy your trophy. You need this as private stash. Salud. Enough with the pics. Victory Danny. I thought I was Bebe Tigre. Nah. Danny Roja will be bigger than El Tigre. You know why? Because your war will fucking end. Viva la moral! Si! Viva la moral! <laughs> There's something about third world prisons. They make me hard. As you can see, Mr. McKay, everything is under control. Good old shakedown. I love it. Did they do it? Who the fuck cares? <laughs> the Admiral was a lamb. She did not have the stomach needed to deal with the terroristas. I would like you to consider expanding your operations. Look, you Are you a legend? Open the cell. We respect. El Presidente has a strict... Open it! Did you fight with Santos Espinosa in the 67 Revolution? I drove a tank right through the doors of the Capitolio in the Battle of Esperanza. I was there when we took your grandfather. I watched them die. Why did you hate him? The only thing a Castillo has done for Yara is rape our land. And you will do the same thing now. You don't know that. I do! And if you lose in this chains, I will wrap my hands around your little throat and save Yara from another Castillo! Or you can do your country a favor and kill yourself. <laughs> we should have someone look at that mule. It's not mine. <laughs> But I get the feeling I should be. Hell yes! Okay, it's on, Danny. Have a drink with me at Judge's. It's a bar west of Concepcion Bay and north of Gran Hotel Caballero. You got it, Elena. <laughs> Clara, the Admiral is dead. That's a huge blow to Anton's military. Well done, Danny. Some of the people here are a little too quick to celebrate. We party after Anton is dead. He's going to make Alessi suffer for the death of Benitez.
The ancianos keep talking about their glory days. This party is aging me 30 years. Let's go. We're doing our own thing. We need Honron. She's at a house on the beach. I'll drive. Let's ride. Neither one of us is keeping an eye out for trouble. Danger of the port bow, mis amores. Through Sharon's are under attack. Clara is to leave her of terrorizing this town. She claims to be a true Jaran, but her brain is so thick with foreign mierda that she could build a new island with it and go live on one. I forgot my brother's <laughs> with some of this. I was not busy this time. I don't think I knew what I was doing. All I know about that is You can ride shotgun, Danny. I'm humble like that. I'm not drunk. I calculated my alcohol. I'm good to drive. You sure? I'm fine. So, here's why you're really here. I just got off the phone with Castillo. What? He said, if I turn you in, he will release all of the outcasts in El Este. You're joking, right? It's for the greater good, Danny. What? Aren't you ready to sacrifice yourself for the good of Yara? <laughs> Coño. You're fucking with me. Of course I am. Shit. Lighten up, Danny. Besides, I give up Lorenzo first. Where are we going? First to Honron, then our island. With Benita instead, it's safe to go back there. You have an island? It was our place to hang out, hook up, drink. I'd go there to study. Hell of a mix. <laughs> Honron and her brother showed it to me. Honron has a brother? Yeah. He and I... We had a thing. No shit. Where is he? I need another drink for that story. We're here. Hey! Let's get this party started! I was studying while you were playing games. Hey, it's trying. That counts. <laughs> what are you? The fucking UN? Let's get Danny a trophy for trying. What's next? Is this gonna be party Jelena or wiki Jelena? Fuck off. You getting the grill? You know how I feel about using that thing. Animals have goddamn brains too. You know dolphins can use tools? Cojone, there was a beautiful second I forgot you were vegan. Can you show Danny where the grill is? Yeah, yeah, you monsters. Danny, grab that. I'll show you where to find meat or fish to cook. 
or plant-based food for the good of your soul. 